welcomed the project for union of the colonies. He believed that Confederation was certain and that it would give islanders greater weight in dealing with the landhold system. He attended the Charlottetown and Quebec conferences, but he had to face the fact that the Confederation was deeply unpopular. Unpopular locates returned from Quebec. William became involved in a bitter conflict within his party over the issue. Such discord remembered in the formation of a new consecutive government in January 1865, led by his younger brother James Collodge Pope, whose position on Confederation was doubtful. William resigned as a dictator, counselor, and colonel secretary in 1866, and never again stood for elective office. William remained editor of the Islanders, who aims in mind confederation for the Islanders, the end, and reconstruction in the consecutive party with a strong confederate <coughs> prince, the means. The strategy was to promote discord within the liberals who won the general election in 1867, but who had leadership problems of their own and were divided on the land and school questions. William expo exploded the latter by adv advocating limited financial support to Catholic education industrians and pr pressing Catholic to force their case. In 1870, the Liberals lit over the school question with all Catholic legislators except one joining the second James Clause Pope government, which made the building of railways its policy. The project for the m which William had advanced for years prov provided far too expensive for the Islanders' treasury, and on July 1st, 1873, the Islanders entered the Dominion of Canada.